Hello everyone, thank you for checking out my channel and welcome to another tech series. <laughs> Hello everyone, in this video you're gonna learn how to insert a blank page in a document and what is the importance of page break okay now first i have to introduce you the show and hide button so this button shows what's going on in your document like if you use enter if you have unnecessary spaces and so on okay so first click this button you will find it here at the home tab paragraph group and show or hide command. So click lang natin yan. Then makikita mo, meron tayo ditong indicator. Okay? So this means, uh, this one, kung nakikita mo, this means you used enter to separate the line. And this period here, small period here, indicates that you used spaces. Okay? Now, uh, this will help us to identify what's going on on our document. Now, how to insert a blank page in our document? Let's say uh, we forgot to insert a part of our paper or document. Okay, so uh, here is my table of contents and my chapter one. So, I'd like to have an abstract before this chapter one starts okay how are we going to insert another page between the table of contents and our chapter one okay so all i have to do is to click here at the very first character ng ating page okay then uh click lang natin yan go to insert tab and go to pages you will see here the pages or the page break command so click lang natin yan to add a blank page okay so if we use this uh, page break uh, whenever we write he text here okay and we use enter and enter okay you'll notice that our succeeding page will not affect it okay so, ano yung, uh, ano yung difference na sinasabi ko? Okay. So, let's say hindi tayo gumamit ng page break and we use enter, enter, enter. This is the usual um, thing na ginagawa natin to create a new page. We use enter until our document or the letter would appear on the next page. So, yan. Ito yung usual na ginagawa natin. So, kapag ganito, if we write text here, ayan, series of text, you'll notice that every time we enter in this page, and our succeeding page will be affected as well. You see that? So instead of doing this, let's forget uh, the usual thing na ginagawa natin. So instead of uh, using enter key to create a new page, let us use the page break command okay so go to insert click page break and that's it so every time you write here text nakikita mo uh, meron tayong page break indicator here so it should be in we conducted a page break in this part of the document okay go inside here the page break okay and then the page break and then uh, in here you start typing your text Let's say I want to insert abstract, abstract, okay, and hit enter. And so yung abstract ko is same lang dun sa mga title ko, which use the heading one. So go to uh, home tab, then click heading one, okay. So I've discussed these uh, styles on my previous video. So if you still do not see uh, the previous video about styles, kindly check it out okay then hit enter for our content and let's say i write here sample data okay, 
So, I have here sample data. And, konti lang yung gamitin ko. Yeah. Let's say this is my abstract. Okay. This is my abstract. Layout lang natin. So, if you have already an abstract there at your document, so you can use it na. Okay? Uh, 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 I'd like to show you lang kung paano po ginagamit yung page break or how to insert another page without even manipulating your texts. Okay? And the right way para gawin yun. Okay, let's say this is my abstract. Now, okay, so by this, we've already inserted po another page in, uh, in between the pages of our document. Okay, so I've executed already. Now, as you can see here in a date table of contents, it is not yet updated. So, wala pa ditong abstract. So, ano yung kailangan natin gawin? All we have to do is to click this update table. Click update table, update entire table, and there you go, you have our abstract, which we inserted between the table of contents and our first part of the document. Okay? So, that's how you use page break, and that's how you insert another page in between pages of your document. Okay, so thank you. I hope you'd learn something today. Bye.